This is Ran Man. I'm back. Hit that cash app. Dollar sign Ran 8239. Let's go. And this topic I'm talking about believing in yourself, seeing the vision. Yes, that's right. Believing in yourself, seeing the vision. Now, other people might not see what you see in yourself, but what you see in yourself, you go by that. And if you got that desire to do whatever, you know, want to better your life and want to do better as a person, you know, you go by that vision you seen that God allows you to see. Yes. And like, I can give you examples of some of the visions that I've seen that I accomplish in life. For one example, uh, back in 2008, like when I wanted to move to Tennessee, I seen the vision before it actually happened. So when I left Alabama to go up there to Tennessee, I already had things planned of why I wanted to go, what I wanted to do, and where I wanted to stay already in place. Now, I set aside resources for me to go up there. And also, I mapped out a lot of different places and different areas I was looking at. I mapped that out before I drove up there and packed all my things. <laughs> But yeah, that vision I had and I accomplished that I had moved to Nashville, Tennessee. I lived there for over, what, five years. That's one accomplishment that I was proud of that I can say it really helped me grow and helped me build as a person, as a man. And also, too, another accomplishment I had in the past. This was back in 2019 that I seen the vision of as I really wanted to research because I always wanted to go out the country. I always wanted to do that. But I was kind of nervous at first until I started watching a lot of videos on YouTube of these travelers. See, we didn't have the passport bros back then, but it was a guy. His name was Passport Heavy on his channel. And what country stuck out to me that I really wanted to go at the time was Panama City, Panama. I remember he was like, oh, man, this city is so beautiful, so gorgeous. He had a beautiful lady with him, a Panamanian chica. Oh, and he was just showing a beautiful landscape and stuff. And I was like, wow, man, that city looks beautiful, man. I, then I just started doing research about it. And then from the next step, I was like, man, I got to go ahead and apply for my passport. You know, like I said, I was kind of nervous, like, ah, uh, I don't really fly a lot because back then in 2019, I really hadn't been on a plane that much. Like the only time I really was getting on a plane was like when I was living in Minnesota, uh, my first plane trip when I was in Minnesota was to Las Vegas and from Las Vegas I flew from Las Vegas then I flew to California from Minnesota too um, a couple times and yeah that was it but yeah when I got my passport I got that and made that accomplishment I seen a vision then from there I went to Panama Matter of fact, I'd have been to Panama three times so far. And I loved it there. It's a nice city. Um, it's not my favorite country, but I love the city of Panama. It's nice. I mean, I ain't got a desire to just live there. But I definitely go back and visit. Most definitely. But believing in yourself, seeing the vision. And see from now. From this point, from 2019 all the way to 2023, I'd already been to um, three other countries. 
Well, matter of fact, four other countries. I take that back because I went to Canada too later on in 2019 when I went to after I went to Panama. So I've been to four countries actually. Um, Panama, Peru, Ecuador, and um, Canada. Yep. So yeah, I've seen those visions of going to these places before I did, and I accomplished that. So that's what made me happy and bring me joy. And like I say, already now, Colombia is like home to me. Cause I got some establishment there. I got amigos there. I got chicas there. I have, uh, you know, a lot of things going in Colombia for me. And I lived there last year for over three months, almost four months. Yeah, that accomplishment I made. And like I say, I seen a vision before it happened. Thank God I was able to do it. God allowed me to get there and do that. But yeah, I just want to encourage anybody out there, they see a vision in themselves, uh, you know, go by, you know, keep pushing until it happens. You know what I'm saying? Like, it's never too late. As long as you got breath in your body, you can move around. You got legs to walk on, arms, you know, all your body functioning fine. You know, you have this opportunity. So, yeah, this is Rayman. I'm out. Peace out.